Hi everyone, it's Angie with Scentsy, and I wanted to talk to you about our new spring bricks. Um, I wanted to talk to you first, what is a brick? And bricks are 15 ounces of wax in a huge bar compared to our regular bar. Um, this is a brick, this is a regular bar. Um, our bricks are 15 ounces, our bars are 3.2. $5, $20, so it's a really great deal. Okay, so Scentsy has six um, fragrances for these um, limited edition bricks. Um, if you are it in any way interested in them, go ahead and order one um, ASAP because we are not guaranteed them um, through the end of the month. So um, if you're on the fence, I'm here to tell you what these are like so you can get off the fence and put it in an order. So um, the first one I wanted to review was the sea salt and avocado. So this one, I wasn't sure I like it, but it is really fresh and um, it reminds me of a cucumber scent. So if you like the sweet cucumber family, it doesn't have that exact cucumber smell, obviously. Um, it's very distinct to a cucumber, but this avocado is in that same family. So if you like um, like a sweet grass or a um, the grass, um, fresh cut daisies last season, that one was one similar to this, um, but they're just fresh green. Um, when I think of this, I think of green, the um, grass, the um, cucumbers. So you will not be disappointed with this fresh, um, scent of this sea salt and avocado. So any of you that like that fresh cut, cut grass, the um, fresh cut daisies, um, dandelion smell kinda, um, that's a little more strong, but I'm telling you cucumber smell, this is it. So, um, and I know I have a really good friend that hates cucumbers, so this would not be for you. Okay, so the other ones that we have is this this one is called bergamot and driftwood and I love this one it is um, really light but warm um, I some years ago I think um, Calvin Klein came up with some fabric uh, a fat fragrance that could be used for men or women and I want to say it's called CK1 that is what this reminds me of it's those same notes um, you can definitely smell the citrus, but the bergamot, it's just that little spice. It is such a balanced scent. Um, I could see men and women enjoying this equally. Um, I love it. It is probably the top of this list for these six scents. Um, this one is a go-to, like I said, if you like... Um, the, the more manly scents like um, Thunderstorm. I think it has the Southern Evening kind of has these um, notes in it. Um, let me see, there's some citrus in it too. So it kind of is very unique. But if you're a fan of bergamot, then I think this is the go-to for you. Okay, um, citrus and rosemary is what I think of for a kitchen scent. It is I love it. It has, it's not citrus like lemon, it's citrus like orange. So to me, I feel like it smells like a kitchen should smell. Um, clean, but spicy. Um, there's the just the right hint of rosemary. I know that rosemary can be very strong and in cooking and distinct to the smells and the taste, but I think that this is just the right balance of the citrus. And it's not just orange, it's the lemon zest in there as well. This one, I could put it in my kitchen all summer. And even in Thanksgiving, I feel like I could warm this in Thanksgiving and it would fit in perfect. I just think this is such a balanced scent. I love it and I hope it comes back in some form um, because I think it's, in that same lemon sorbet, um, coconut lemongrass. I feel like if you like those scents, then you will like this. Uh, the next one is, I love it. 
another one that I love because I'm drawn to sandalwood scents and this is a sandalwood. Um, Persian lime and sandalwood. This is um, a very nice manly scent. So if you are drawn to your mystery man, your my dear Watson, all of those um, more masculine scents, then this is going to be for you. Um, it's a little more earthy than those scents, but it still has those notes of those scents. But that's why I love it. The sandalwood is really an anchor in this, and it keeps it from being my dear Watson. This one is earthier and it's got that hint of the sheer wood in this season's um, fragrances and so if you like that one this one is um, earthy and um, spicy it I want to say it's kind of like old spice but in a good way like uh, a man walking by wearing a cologne that has that balance of spice and warmth and um, it just works and um, that's what this is to me um, I love it I am cannot wait to put this in my warmer and the last one um, I did not order one of them and that's the white amber peach because I just not a fan of that one I had um, smelled it in the skin line and I just it's just not my scent um, I do have customers that love it so um, don't let my opinion of it sway you. If you like that amber and peach, um, it kind of reminds me of the southern peach tea in um, our wax this season. Uh, you'll love that one as well. This pineapple coconut vanilla is your Hawaiian tropic, your banana boat, suntan oil. Um, it kind of reminds me of our vanilla orchid scent. Um, this is not your typical vanilla. I'm not a fan of like the vanilla vanilla scent. This is your warm vanilla at the end note. It anchors it. It keeps it from being over the top coconut. Um, pineapple is that little bit of the citrus and, and acid in it. Um, but it is, if you like uh, banana banana um, banana boat um, Hawaiian tropic any of those fragranced um, suntan oils if you're drawn to that then this is it this is this I am very drawn to um, those kind of things I love suntan oil it brings back great memories for me in childhood and even now I smell my suntan oil and because it's I don't know. I just am more attracted to the smell than so sometimes the marketing of it. It's um, smell for me. But um, this is a definite for any of you with beach houses or anybody that is just a fan of um, tropical smells. This is you. So I hope this helps you to um, want to venture out and try a brick. Um, you won't be disappointed. I always tell some of my customers that have friends that are Scentsy fans, um, each of your friends buy one and that you both like and split them. You can each get six big cubes and um, it it's just um, a nice way to um, share and both of you get some large quantities of um, a very new and unique um, fragrance line that since he has come up with. I haven't smelled anything um, just quite this unique in a long time and I love it and I hope that you will try it. If you're interested, they're $20. Please just message me or um, text me or email me and I'll process the order and we'll get them in as soon as possible. I just don't want anyone to be disappointed because they might sell out. So. $20 for almost a pound of wax and um, I would love I've got these I'm getting ready to do samples if you are a hostess this um, month the last last part of this month I'll be sending out some of these to hand out um, but like I said don't wait because I'm not even sure how long they'll be around so let me know if I can get um, put one in for you thanks and have a great Monday